Okay, I changed the few settings that were auto to manual. Okay, sounds like it's better now. <laughs> We did it, Reddit! <laughs> okay, I'm glad to hear it's much better now. Now is probably what it was supposed to be in the first place. Yeah, I researched the video tag. Okay, glad to hear it's working fine. I need a quick break though, get a drink. <laughs> a celebratory coffee, so be right back. I'm back. So now I'm mad that I was streaming in shitty quality for almost two hours. <laughs> But at least it's fixed now, so that's a positive. Anyway, let's at least get to day 100, shall we? Because I'd like to know what exactly is going to happen then, when evaluation happens. Oh yeah, I can guarantee that it annoys me far more than it annoys you guys. <laughs> Same with audio. Like, I, I think that's a thing that a lot of YouTubers and streamers have. They get way more annoyed about their audio and stuff like that than people who actually watch. Same with video quality. I definitely made changes to my audio setup over the years that hardly anyone even noticed. <laughs> but I did, that's the important part. It doesn't matter, nobody noticed, I knew. <laughs> Anyway, we got a meteor storm starting in one hour. That's definitely not a good thing. Pipe leak reported. Okay, that's a lot of concrete. Right, maybe we don't want to move literally all of it. This is going to be quite enough. Building's not working. Yeah, metals. There are plenty of metals here. 18 machine parts, so that's fine. Two souls for the meteor storm, that's rough. Hopefully it won't be too close to us. Anomaly analyzed. New takes available for research. Martian, bold, planet, uh, Martian born resilience and Martian born strength, okay. Let's see. Martian born don't take sanity damage from disasters. Martian born don't take sanity damage when working in out dome buildings. Okay. We are working on CO2 jet propulsion. This should help our transport efficiency a lot. That's the general idea. Okay, back we go. Now, since we are working that water extractor, let's maybe get started on the dome. Let's see. I think I would prefer a smaller one here for now. That requires, right, some metals and polymers. Let's move that first. We should have a lot of polymers. 13 and 5. We got 36 total. Yeah, there are 11 up here. Let's grab them then. So all polymers. And right, metals. 
We'll need to go up here for metals. Oh yeah, the colony definitely slowly shifts to all Martian born, that's for sure. Alright, and off we go. Free trees, thanks for subscribing. Appreciate the support. With sharp text now. <laughs> Now 50% more sharp text. Oh, the drones actually unload that themselves, so we don't Mission have to do it manually. Alright. Marsgate, Isocorp. One of Earth's largest tech conglomerates. It reads. Okay, so Mission Control received a direct communique from Esocorp, one of Earth's largest tech conglomerates. Please read. Please be advised that Object 6EZ-3 will be operating within a respectful distance of your mission. You are not to approach it under any circumstance, under threat of legal and other punitive measures. What are they going to do? Sue us on Mars? Nothing further was added and no effort to even mimic adherence to standard protocol guidelines was made. Our Earth partners are giving their best to question ISOCORP and to get to the bottom of this. Who do these guys think they are? Yeah, damn right. Can we actually see anything on the map now? Not yet, at least. I assume we'll find something sooner or later. Some anomaly. Okay, I'm quite interested to see where this goes. So, do we have enough for a dome now? We should. 21 metal. Just barely enough. Well, barely enough is still enough, right? So, let's get started on this. We definitely don't want it on the cold ground, that's for sure. And not too close to the deposits. So yeah, just somewhere in the middle. It will have to do, I suppose. Okay, right here is good. Then some power cables. And pipes. Yeah, whatever we do, you're only 50 million kilometers away from them. Pretty much. Okay, another anomaly. Let's send the explorer to do his thing. Which one is even the closest at this point? Like this one. Okay, let's go check that out then. Fifty-five average comfort. Seven colonies couldn't satisfy their interest. Social. Alright, I think it's time to build some services for them. We could just build a space bar, it's fairly cheap, doesn't require a lot of maintenance. And it provides relaxation and drinking and social. If we want to go more fancy, we could build a casino complex, but... That's 36 electronics, not worth it in a smaller dome, I don't think so. Alright, let's just build a space bar, that's fine. We should have more than enough resources in the area. Anomaly found. Another new anomaly over here. That's probably from the meteors. That's definitely from the meteors. It would be nice to get the Mega Dome at some point. Well, hopefully we'll be able to. That requires... where was it? The research was available somewhere in here. Yeah, right here. 15,000 research. It's pretty expensive. 
But we'll get it eventually. Sector scanned. Alright, let's move some more resources. Some machine parts. Some metals. Actually, all the metals, I guess. We've just confirmed the location Anomaly of the which deposit. Discovered a metal a deposit. Act. Yeah, alright. Don't really need that, but sure. Research complete. And we got CO2 jet propulsion. Okay, so now we can get the shuttle hub. Definitely need that ASAP. Factory AI. Factory performance increased by 20%. With no downside. That's nice. Shuttle speed increased. Right now we got bioengineering queued up. So farms increase comfort of all residences in the dome. We got a farm in every dome right now. So that's definitely worth it. We can improve RC transport as well, and might as well queue up Drone Hub, since we still can't build our own Drone Hub. We had no need to do that, but we will soon. So back to the Explorer. Now that the dome is ready, vehicle battery low. let's see. Wait, which one is that? Oh, they're over. Well, we can just make it stand on the cable. Anyway, apartments. Yeah, sure, apartments will be fine. That does require eight polymers. But we are making our own, so not really a problem. Oh, and how expensive is that hub? Hold on, maybe we should build that first. Where's the shuttle hub? There it is. Okay, it requires one fuel. One fuel refinery should be enough. Our daily production is 12. How much fuel do we have stored at the moment? 116. Yeah, okay, so that's not a problem at all. We need 12 polymers, 8 electronics, 8 concrete. Okay, so where do we want it? Somewhere in our core area, I would say. I don't think the exact location matters too much. Just not too close to extractors. Up here would be good enough. Okay, yeah, that's good enough. It's not too close to any extractor. This is about the closest one. And it's roughly a central area. I think we have enough resources. One more polymer needed. Object six easy three. Mars gate. Has made motives unknown. On surface, not too far from base. Our readings suggest it's intact and operational. So far, we can deduce it is only patrolling the area, as we can't detect sophisticated science instruments from the observation range. The landing, however, was seen by some of our colonists and. Questions are being raised. Questions we currently can't answer. Our Earth partners have so far fallen short from picking up on any new information and are currently preparing to take the issue to the UN. Okay. Soon we may, soon we may have to take things into our own hands. 
Okay, that's curious. Day 93, so evaluation is close. There's the shuttle hub. So now we get the shuttles. I assume they will just operate on their own. Yep. Looks that way. That should make things way more convenient. It's just that it requires fuel, but that's not really a problem. So I assume they will bring polymers here without us having to transport them manually. Now, more anomalies. There's one all the way to the east. That's a little bit far away, but it should be fine. Oh, that's the experimental vehicle. Interesting. Okay, can we nuke it from orbit? <laughs> it's just roaming right now. Well, let's go closer, why not? Can we interact with it using our explorer? I don't think so. Pipe leak reported. Well, I want the anomaly, so there's that. Just watch our battery. Yes, we got a CB on them now. <laughs> oh, it's gone. All right. So this should be worth some science. We got the apartments, so... Next up, I don't even think we need a farm, honestly. We are making so much food. Yeah, I don't think we need a farm. We could make up for it by building, like, a bigger garden and stuff like that. Lake. Small fountain. Fountain. There's a statue available in here. Also, what about spires? We got a medical center. Actually, no, we haven't researched that yet. Well, we could always get the archaeology later. It's not even a bad idea. Alright, well, from the basics, we need, like, a diner or a grocer. Diner is fine. And infirmary. Here you go. And then, like, a park or something. Let's see. Yep, right here in the middle. Good enough, so now the drones will bring the resources. That is so much more convenient. Anomaly analyzed. Yeah, we could make this a research focus dome. That's not a bad idea. I might do that. There's our research, so back we go. Day 94. I suppose we can still move some food manually. Might as well do that. And now we can grab the passengers. Not much point waiting, I don't think so. Alright, so. Passenger rocket. 49 out of 77. If we want this to be a research specialized dome, we'll want scientists, obviously. We don't really need botanists. At least one medic, maybe two medics. And really, that's about it. We could get the rest with no specialization. So let's review. At least one medic. 
Let's get full medics. Then scientists. And the rest will be people with no specialization. Here, alright, that's good enough. Let's go. And we'll build a research lab or two. There's the research lab. We don't have the Science Institute unlocked just yet, so research lab will have to do. There just aren't many available anymore, so we can't really afford to be picky. This would be a good moment to start thinking about the Martian University, but we haven't researched that yet, so that's not an option yet. Research complete. Bioengineering, okay. Next up, transport optimization that will improve the RC transport. And then drone hub. Did we unlock anything new? No. Moisture farming, yeah. We just unlocked that. So this will unlock the moisture evaporator. We don't need that anymore, but I suppose it might be useful at some point. Also, what about the breakthroughs, since we still have a few in here? Doubles the performance bonus when colonists are working on a heavy workload. Yes, that is nice. Sector scanned. There's the research lab. Now back to the explorer. I think this is like a separate high ground that we can't get to without a tunnel. Yep, we definitely can't get out there without a tunnel. There are a few more anomalies all the way to the north. Let's go check them out. More research. Six more days until our evaluation. This is quite enough food. We should look into building a drone hub up here. Still haven't researched that. It's queued up, right? Yep, it's queued up. For now, the rover will do. Our first underground water deposit is almost depleted. I think we're going to need another water extractor once that gets depleted. So this one. This one is very low quality. Well, or this one. But then we'll need a drone hub. No, this should be fine. Just move slightly closer. Resources yeah, that will be low. fine. Low on polymers. We're not low on polymers, we got 18. That will be fine. Building performance, 34. That is not amazing, actually. Any issues in this dome? Average comfort, 73. Anomaly found. And here's another anomaly. That should be quite a lot of research right there. Like, at least 5,000. Maybe queue up a few more techs. Well, we got 11,000 worth of techs queued up. Anything cheap in here that will be useful? Uh, 
Residences in basic domes have improved comfort. Yeah, we should get that. It's not a cheap tech, but we got three basic Research domes and complete. one medium right now. There's transport optimization. How's our rare metal deposit? 684 left out of 1000. So this is still fine. We won't run out anytime soon. Yes, I'm aware. 18 now. The factory is working just fine. Yeah, I definitely want to get to 100, but I want to see what happens. We are pretty close. Anomaly analyzed. 1500, nice. We should have enough battery left. I think. Well, it's safer to go reload, I suppose. We can actually kind of see him moving from this level. Even when it's zoomed out all the way. Are we not keeping up with Polymer's demand? They keep going down. No, it should be fine. They just need to work harder, clearly. Plenty of fuel around here. Oh, and the rocket has arrived. Okay, well, let's land. Preferably in range of the rover. This should be fine. What's the range of the rover? Right here. Yeah, it's pretty small. I suppose we can always just move it. Okay, up here is good enough. Research complete. How much does another rocket cost to buy? Well, I can check. Three billion. It's pretty expensive. I got three rockets, so I don't really need one. But some of the sponsors only start with like one, I think. Here, we got the drone hub. And we can go check out more anomalies. All the way over here. New colonists have arrived. And there are the colonies. First 12 colonies in our new dome. And we just need to move the food. Right, so we need to move the rover a little bit. Or actually, hold on, will the flying drones do it? I don't think so, no. No, Sector I don't scan. think they will do it. Alright, let's just move. Here, that will be fine. Slightly more. Still slightly more. There, now it's in range. But some of the buildings are not. We might need that hub. <laughs> Well, we can refuel it at least. The rover only has eight drones, so they can't do everything all at once. Anomaly analyzed. All right, what else is happening? We got some anomalies. Pipe leak reported. Let's just build a drone hub now that we finish the research. We'll need one over here sooner or later anyway. And it's not like it's super expensive. So... I would say it's somewhere close to the storage area. Yeah, that's good enough. That shouldn't take too long to build. And 
and then we won't need the rover over here anymore. We might want to export some rare metals, however. Yeah, let's maybe do that. I'm just going to move them manually this time. They should be up here. Yeah, that's a lot. Uh, actually, we should have another storage in the center. Oh, and now we have up to 45 capacity. That's helpful. Oh, apparently the flying drones will do it on their own. But we can speed it up by doing it manually. Any problems in here? Average comfort, 40. They want gaming. Yeah, alright. SOR0, thanks for subscribing. Appreciate the support. Oh, and we need a name for this dome. Any ideas? So far we got Flat Mars Society, Domey McDomeface, and... Petra. Actually, since this is supposed to be a science-focused dome, let's call it... Valens Secret... Oh, okay, Valens Secret Lab, that will do. So now it's Valens Secret Lab. Speaking of which, is one lab going to be enough? We can open another work shift. Okay, and what do they need again? Gaming. Gaming, luxury and shopping. Seriously, guys? You're not here for gaming. Like, you should have stayed on Earth for that. Still finishing the drone hub. There it is. Okay. You know what we could use? More actual drones. I don't think we ever built a facility for that. I don't think we ever actually researched it. Yeah, that's the drone assembler. We never actually researched that. We can bring more drones from Earth. That's certainly a possibility. They are not exactly expensive, so you know what? Let's do that. And then... More resources will not hurt. We got a fair bit of funding. I don't think I want any prefabs. We're good. Yeah, we'll just bring some resources and some drones. 20 drones. 25 drones. Or even more. Okay, 30 drones, 25 machine parts and electronics and 20 polymers. Good enough, off we go. Then refuel this guy. We're doing it. Which is supposed to be fuel? I don't think... Yeah, this is fuel. Average comfort 47. It's going up a little bit. And yeah, we should probably build more flying drones. Construct a shuttle. Free electronics, five polymers. Yeah, we can get at least one more. That should be okay. But these things are not exactly cheap. Day 98, so evaluation is coming. In two more days. We got 127 colonists. It would be doable to get 200 
the genius died. Yeah, looks like it. We got the celebrity, the saint, and the guru left. We kept the genius for a while. This is looking good. Still loading that. Yeah, definitely need more drones here. Six drones is not enough. Sector scanned. Oh, and we still got anomalies to check out. Right. That's the experimental one. From the Mars Gate event. We should be getting some update about that pretty soon. This is a little bit far, but it should be okay. How's our research queue? Still a lot in here. We are about to finish the breakthrough, so that will double the performance bonus when colonists are working on a heavy workload. To get 200. I think you would have to focus hard on that early. Yeah, I agree. It would be doable to get 200, but you would really have to focus on that hard. Research complete. Oh, and speaking of outsourcing, I think we can, well, not right now, after our next export. But after our next export, we can get some more outsourcing done. And our rocket is here. So let's land it in this general area. Yep, good enough. Day 99, so evaluation is coming. There's the breakthrough. Next up is the next breakthrough, so buildings construct themselves slowly without drones. Nanites will seek out resources from nearby resource depots. And then down bioscaping. Did we unlock anything interesting? Let's see, moisture farming, that was already here before. Rover printing, can construct RC rover, RC transport and RC explorer. That's nice, but we have no need for that. Okay, we didn't unlock anything new right now. All right. Yeah, if you get the tech that allows you to bring 10 more people, that would make it much easier. That's a lot of drones. <laughs> yeah, that's 30 drones. Okay. So go do your thing. Anomaly analyzed. There's the anomaly, that's 1000. I think we'll have to start gathering concrete soon again, because I shut that down. Since we didn't need more. Still got 400, but you know. Let's just clear this completely, it doesn't need to be here anymore. How many drones at this hub? Where's the hub even? 11. And this one, 36. Yeah, 36 is definitely enough. Still refueling. So, day 99. Shopping, gaming, luxury, relaxation. Oh yeah, all the relaxation buildings are full. 
Well, hey, we actually don't have one. It's just full. We detect and monitor four oh, more that's objects as more they parachute down things. and make landfall. Marsgate, a silent them invasion. A resemblance to object 6EZ3. Isocorp is totally silent about this second batch that we believe to be some sort of surveying rovers. More colonists have witnessed the landings and are openly concerned about what they perceive to be an invasion. Calm the general public down, we need answers. Okay, it's getting interesting. So now there are four of them. And it's super close to our dome, though. As the evaluation day dawns upon us, we can clearly say that the mission to Mars was a success. Okay. Even that we didn't surpass the expectations, the stable trends of development of the colony are encouraging our achievements, blah blah blah. Effect. Mission evaluation objective completed. You have 132 colonies out of 200 present on the planet. Final score, 4158. Oh, so that wasn't, like, a hard goal. Interesting. Okay. Well, there you got the answer. That wasn't an actual hard goal. Just like the optimal or something? Well, okay. Yeah. So I wonder what's going to happen with these rovers. It's roaming literally right next to our dome now. Like, come on. Nobody invited you. <laughs> Can we nuke it from orbit? That's clearly the only way to make sure. By the way, is it just me that sees, like, a reverse smiley face in these icons? You can't unsee it once you see it. Like, this icon right here next to the rover looks like a reverse smiley face, upside down. You can't unsee it. Yeah, it's good to know it's not just me. So here's our score. Evaluation. Our total score so far is 24,856. With a difficulty bonus 315%. I have no idea how that compares to anyone else, but here you go. <laughs> yeah, forward settling even on Mars. Damn right. Can't escape from it, even in this game. Alright, well, let's maybe get some more people, shall we? How are the domes doing? This one is doing just fine. Comfort 65. Sector scanned. Plenty of food. No resources. Any more anomalies to scan? Uh, also, the rocket is ready for takeoff. So off you go. Back to Earth you go. We still got one more anomaly. Yep, all the way to the west. And we got one down here. Let's go check out that one. That's like an actual event. Hey, maybe that will be related to Marsgate? Probably not, but who knows. Oh, 
Oh, how's our water deposit? It was depleting. 100 left. Okay, so this is literally about to completely deplete. Time to build a new water extractor then. Uh, where the heck is it? Right here. Okay, so not too close to the dome. This should be fine. Okay, this should be fine. Obviously cable. And pipes. That will do. This should cover our water needs. And then some. Isocorp stopped giving us the there. silent treatment. Mars Gate, take it or leave it's it. It's clear from their message. They're not going to answer our questions. They propose a deal. We fix one of their malfunctioning rovers and they provide a generous, as they put it, funding injection. Their legal team has also warned that any mission should be strictly for repairs and further inspection of the vehicle will be taken as an illegal act. In other words, if we wish, we can send drones to fix the rover, but nothing that can evaluate its purpose, like a rover, and we will be paid for the effort. Interesting. So we have a choice. Not suspicious at all. Okay, how about we save here? Until today, the only place anomaly analyzed the 500 in funding. Out. Nice. Okay, this bar is getting a little bit full at this point. So let's go back and recharge. Are any of them malfunctioning? Yes, this one from the looks of it. Yep. So let's send her over. I want to know why the heck they are here. I don't really care about funding. Funding is boring. I want to check it out. That's what we'll do. So we'll send the explorer. Where was it exactly? Uh, down here, okay. So grab the explorer. And we load our battery to fall down here. Okay, we should move some of these drones. They are not doing anything right now. Reassign them to the actual depot. There should really be a way to like drag a box around the drones or something like that. Especially when you get 30, which is what we got here. But you can't select more than one at a time. Funding received. More funding. That's a rocket that arrived on Earth. Research complete. And the research is done. Construction nanites. So now buildings will build themselves. What else do we have here? Rover printing. We don't need that. Production increased by 30% as long as the building is supplied with fuel. Okay. How about some of the cheap techs? Drone assembler. Yeah, you know what? Let's unlock the drone assembler. Smart homes. Provides a very comfortable living space for colonists. Residents will recover sanity when resting. Sure, we can queue that up. And... Extractor upgrade. Nano refinement is also fine. Okay, yeah, that will do. Now, they're over. Or explorer, whatever. Let's go. It was somewhere down here, right here. I'm really curious. 
what this is going to lead to. They will be mad, <laughs> probably. Yep, the water depleted, which is fine. We had two water extractors over here. Right, let's keep an eye on our water balance. We should be fine. But running out of water would be a very, very bad thing. We can still produce 1.4 more in the, if needed. So let's check this out. Can we analyze it? And no? Okay. Does it look like I can analyze it? We might, we might have to send an actual rover here. First, let's reload that. Vehicle battery low. Yes, I know. Yeah, looks like we actually have to repair it first because I can't interact with it in any way. So let's bring the RC rover. I'm just recharging it. Art workshop, luxury and shopping. You know what, let's build an art workshop. That's not super expensive at this point. We can afford it. And people wanted both luxury and shopping in here. Alright, let's go. Let's see what this is going to lead to. Sector scanned. Anomaly found. More anomalies. Select a sector to scan. And it looks like we found a deep water deposit. Yep, right here. Average quality. Okay then. Okay, we're here. So let's see what this is all about. Oh, so we can either repair or salvage it. I think that's what it's about. Well, let's salvage it, shall we? They will be mad, but I don't care. Here. So will that tell us anything about its purpose? I assume the flying drones will pick this up eventually. Or we can send the transport. Right, let's send the transport, I suppose. And back we go. I got the save, so I can always reload to do it differently. I assume it's not just going to be the resources, because that's kind of boring. Pick all of that up. And back we go. But that's about potentially 50 electronics from 5 drones. 50 electronics isn't too bad. Water situation seems fine. So there's the art workshop that will provide luxuries and shopping. That will definitely increase comfort. Up to 66 now. 
And I guess we can grab like a park or something like that. Alleys. Yeah, sure. Because one small garden isn't quite enough, as far as I can tell. Come on, give me some update. Are they mad yet? <laughs> that we stripped their drone? Uh, no update just yet. Hopefully we'll get something. How's research going? How about we bring some more people? How's our capacity? 14 out of 24 and 32 out of 32. Okay. 64 out of 70. 28 out of 28. Which dome has the highest comfort? This one from the looks of it. Domi McDom face. We could finish off the large dome, I suppose. That makes sense. I don't really want to wait for smart homes, because that will still take a while. How long would we have to wait for that? If we move drone printing. Maybe not that long. I think there was still an anomaly for some research. We got two more anomalies for research. So let's maybe wait for smart homes. And send the explorer. Still no update about Mars Gate. Oh yeah, it feels way better than Planet Base. No doubt about that. We got so much waste rock lying around at this point. And the rocket is ready for takeoff. Off you go then. And then all the drones should move to the drone hub. Yeah, so now we got nine orphaned Sector drones, scan. but I can't select all of them at once. I just have to move each one of them manually, which is a little bit tedious. It seems like a bit of an oversight, not having a way to select multiple drones. Hopefully it will get patched in at some point. Alright, let's go grab the research. The metal deposit is running a little bit low. It would be nice to get the tech for deep deposits at this point. 